What's up, everybody? I'm Boo Carlisle. Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Asphalt. As you can tell, it is the holly jolly time of year. Christmas time is here again. Time for the big fat man in red to come sliding down the chimney. No, I ain't talking about me because I got red on. Anyway, we're headed up to Day North, 85 on 85, up to Claremont, North Carolina to hang out with the Huffmans. It is their annual Christmas party that Landon Huffman throws. So we're going to slide through the other side of Hickory and go check out our buddy Dylan Wilson and his mother, Tammy Wilson, who has a restaurant called Blondie. So uh figure we don't get up to that area very much. So uh, we're going to make a little family trip out of it today. we got our Christmas sweaters ready to go. But with all that said, let's get headed north. A little bit of that 85 on 85. We've been wanting to come here all year. Dylan Wilson's mama's uh, restaurant, Blondie's, right outside Hickory, North Carolina. Oh, brought Santa Claus with it. her mama, Judy. They like BFFs on the on the cars tour. How excited are you, Mama? What a surprise! Oh, what's a surprise? We, we turned the corner. Forward to eating here. Yeah, maybe Miss Tammy's in today. Let's get on in the Blondies, get us a little bite to eat before we get over to the Huffman Christmas party. Nasty weather out. Tammy, you have corn nuggets. <laughs> Mama loves some corn nuggets. Miss oh. Tammy ain't here, maybe she'll come by in a little bit. Y'all check the Blondies place out. Mac and cheese by four dollar and fifty cent. Read what's up on the roof. Uh, we had to order our appetizers while we're here. Uh, Huffman them's gonna have it catered, but we still wanted to come by and support Miss Tammy. Uh, sweater's got a little beer holder in it. So we got our pictures posted on social media. Now we're gonna go back in here and grub a little bit. Can't record much because we got the radio playing in here, but we'll eat here, roll over to Huffman's, have a good time. We got appetizer galore here, some onion rings and some uh, corn nuggets. Mm. Mac and cheese bite. Fred got his tater tots over there praying to the good Lord over his tater tots. We're going to dig in with some ranch. What you think about them mac and cheese bites? Hey, they look awesome. I'm Fred are diving in them tater tots over there. I'm going to hit the onion ring wide open. Uh, leaving the blondies. Our appetizers were delicious. Mom Judy going to drive me and Fred. She's a DD tonight. Get over there. Landon's got some mixology going. He got about eight different drinks. We'll get over there to the Huffman party now with the Saying as elf driving us and we'll be ready to go. But if you ever up in the Hickory area, check out Blondie's. Place was delicious. Got one coming this way and we'll be ready to ride. Oh no, you got a bunch coming that way. 25 minute ride to the Huffman Christmas party. Mighty nasty weather. That ain't a drugstore, mama. Why would a drugstore say ABC? That's a liquor store. Just a little small bottle of Maker's Marks all of them. We ain't racing. Hell, I ain't driving. You drive. Hey, there's one of them pizza parlors again. That other one seemed cool while ago. Me and Fred run in there real quick. We'll be right back out. Come on, Santa Claus. Santa Fred, let's go in. Get us a little splash. Hell, Landon got 60 bottles, he said, of High Rock and 40 <laughs> moonshine jars of, uh, what's that thing called? Shine? Uh, Hell, I can't think of the name of it, but they ain't got no Maker's Mark over there. That orange sickle was what everybody got tore up on last year. I wasn't able to mash gas last year, but nine o'clock. Let's go in here and get us a little bit. So she had Jameson with pickle bait. Where is the wish? There's Jack Daniels. See if I make her smart down through there. See if I got a smaller one. George Dickel. Let's put it in the Dickel. In the dirt. Find it over there for you. Got the little one. Give me a little bottle. I don't want a little bit. Hey, a little low octane. High octane, but not much of it. They even had a litter oil bottle right there. Stuff. Fred, you stick that in your back pocket right there, Santa. You go uh, shake the bale over there and make some money for them. Make a wish. or Huh? Oh, yeah. I got a little thing right there I can stick. Well, I'll show y'all in a little bit. My sweater come with a drink holder. Let's hop back in Mama Judy's sleigh. Let's get on over to the Huffman party. See, I told y'all. He got a little cup holder here right below whatever the animal on this thing is. I just hold it right there. That'd be my little pouch holder right there. I'm gonna hold my maker's mark right here. I got it at the grocery store. What'd you call it? The pharmacy? What? I thought it was a drugstore. All right. Are we ready to go? We are ready to ride. Next okay. stop, Huffman Christmas Racing Party. Like we said, nasty, dreary night. I've already seen people on social media. Yes, Landon is feeding us. We just wanted to go back there and support Miss Tammy, Dylan Wilson, and their family at their restaurant while we was up here. Because it's three and a half hours up here. It ain't like we're up here on Tuesday night eating supper. So that's why I went by and just got appetizers. The Huffman family is going to feed us real good and provide. Landon going to provide enough liquor to put it in the dirt and take it back out of the dirt and put it in the dirt again. So 
the ones that, you know, like I said, if you wonder, no land ain't going to feed you, yes, he's going to feed us. Like I said, been sending on social media already as we drive through this dreary weather. But with that said, let's sneak on to Claremont, North Carolina, and hang out with the Claremont kid. Rolling into the little town of, uh, I guess this is Claremont here. Got the little snowflakes there on the telephone poles. When he said it was small, he wasn't joking. A little, a little one red light town. All right, I was wrong. There's two red lights here. Oh, we're in the wrong lane. We gotta get over. Look, their Merry Christmas sign up there needs a little help. Maybe get up there, landing, get up there, change a few bulbs, or Fred, get up there and change a few bulbs. There you go. Clear low, driver. Clear low. I don't know. Maybe. Well, yeah, there's a lot of the E yeah. out. You have that big time uh, decorating. Uh, we finally made it here. We've been following two cars for about 15 miles, and we, we was right. That was the right place. Mm -hmm. Made it in here to the Huffman party, getting started. Landon finally giving Fred and then what else today. We got, so this is yeah, Fred, what else you want? <laughs> it's an orange sickle. Getting the barbecue ready. Man said they got some banana pudding. This ain't Dairy Queen. They got banana pudding liquor. Y'all like coffee or anything? You got keys, bro. I need some open this. What's the number one thing on your Christmas list you tell Santa to bring you? A new race car. What else is it? What's the number one thing you tell Santa Claus you want for Christmas? I want a grandchild. She better tell Lana, not Santa Claus. P5. Big Rob back, back in his in racing him. days. Yeah, won that baby, bud. Charlotte. Crashed in the no, white car. No, won that baby. In the white car, you crashed. I don't remember who that was. Mark Cox. I don't remember who that was. The eight was, uh, the eight was cruising. Landon got his picture from his 30,000 to win race in the cars tour. Nice beer joint they got here. There'll be plenty of people here to have a good time celebrating a little bit. What's the number one thing on your list tell Santa Claus you want for Christmas? Have my number one thing, it would probably be a house <laughs> because I'm ready to build, but it's so expensive. So, Santa, bring it to me. <laughs> Band's getting set up, so once they start playing music, I'll get the copyright stuff going on, so uh, won't be able to record too much tonight. Let me show you the drinks they got. Come on, Fred, let's talk about them. Name them out one by one the Myrtle Beach Hoe, the Myrtle Beach Hoe, <laughs> and the blue, but no blue balls here. Then the, oh my goodness, it's a family show. Claremont screwdriver has a flathead and a, one of them switch around, flathead on one end. And oh, what got there? Apple shoe, oh my goodness. Oh, that's just something to mix it with there. Let's kill it down there just a little bit. Pick your poison, Fred. What's gonna be your first one? Let's get to reading them. Hell, Mama Judy gonna drive us home tonight back to Jefferson. So I'm gonna go with the mother, woo, 2.0 first and see what that's all about. See if that uh, gets it. Thing. Oh yeah, I'm gonna show y'all too. Check out my my hoodie thing. Got my drink holder from my maker's mold. I can't get it back in there, but y'all seen it's a little holder, a little kangaroo pouch, if you will. All right, LH, tell us what we got. Got a wide array of selection here. Um, each of these are finely crafted. Uh, we've got starting off over here on the far right, Myrtle Beach Ho. Myrtle Beach. You know. Pretty much self-explanatory. <laughs> little pina colada is what the description. The description is, uh, you know, shitty southern paradise that we all love and know mixed into a smooth Saturday night pina colada. A little bit of a Marlboro drag to it. <laughs> Want a RJ cigarette? Yeah, phenomenal <laughs> cocktail for a fresher, if I must say. <laughs> Moving on, we've got blue but not blue balls here. Blue but not blue yeah, balls. It's a blueberry lemonade cocktail. It's really good. Uh, goes the distance. No fake finishers around here. Moving on, we got the motherfucker. <laughs> 2.0. It's 2.0 because last year was 1.0. I'm not going to tell you what's in it. Don't worry about it. Just drink it. <laughs> and then on the very end here, well, we got two left. But the last dispenser is the Claremont screwdriver designed by the Claremont Posse. Seth helped me design this. It's potent. It's exquisitely proportioned. Show us Seth's dance move. Come on. <laughs> show, show us. Claremont box. We'll see it later. Okay, we'll see it later. You'll see it later. And then on the very end... This one didn't deserve a dispenser, so it got a Got the tea jug. Yeah. That's the apple shit. <laughs> and the reason I went with that is uh, some backwoods apple pie cocktail that a dude at Tri-County gave me one time. 
So hopefully people enjoy it. <laughs> Mixologist Landon Huffman got got the Christmas party going. Fred, what's gonna be the first one? I done got the Myrtle Beach hoe. <laughs> Just pick one and start. You got a driver? No blue balls, Rick. No blue balls. Hey, <laughs> you can't go wrong with it. He's no got blue, blue balls. balls in Georgia. <laughs> Hell, he don't need them. North Carolina, too. <laughs> What'd you say? Hey, inform everybody why Solo Cup's got lines. Each line's a... Each line's an ounce. An ounce. So how, let's say how much blue raspberry or whatever it was, blue balls you done got gone. Right there. Oh, okay. So you got a good bit going so far then. I hear you. Myrtle Beach hoes already tickling my pickle over here. <laughs> Talk two now. What they got going on over here? What all we got to eat with grub on tonight? All I know is a little barbecue. Got some wings, I heard her say. Some chicken wings. Some baked beans. Hey, Rob don't play, does he, he when he throws play. a Christmas party? He don't play. Sometimes he just needs a little kick in the butt to get him going. <laughs> Speaking of, going, Rob, there he is right there. There, there he goes. <laughs> Rounders rolling smoke, the one providing it tonight. Tell us what all we got tonight, man. We got some wings, some we barbecue pork. We got some pork. chicken wings, smoked chicken wings, and we deep fried them to give them a little flash fry to make the skin crispy. We got barbecue pulled pork, and we got baked beans, slaw, and some rolls, and three kinds of sauces. Y'all fixed us up good, yes. so uh, tell us where during the week where we can get some barbecue at. Just look us up on Facebook, Rounders Rolling Smoke. My guy finally here, ribs, abs and on, not ribs, Seth Brotherton. They're going to be doing the shuffle. What are you calling? What's your box? <laughs> <laughs> Rub it, it'll get bigger. <laughs> get line over here to get your food. I'm not sure which direction. If you hadn't seen yet, there's a restroom right here. There's one back here in the back corner also. Okay, everybody bow your heads. Come on, Jesus, be our guest. Let these gifts to us be blessed. Amen. Just no order of how you start. Just get in line over here and they'll direct you where to go. All right, let's go get in line. Get some wings, some barbecue. Hey man, food's ready. <laughs> I need to eat something, yeah. Otherwise, I'm be in trouble. Yeah. You be dancing like Seth in a little bit. I'll be sitting in that chair. Yeah. Not you, keep, you keep shaking hands. I'm going to go get some wings. Right, we'll get... I got to wash my wings down with this Myrtle Beach hoe. That's about my third glass and them scuffed the tires in good we starting to show a little wear on them fred's still drinking the blue gator aid and i think landon's hitting a little bit of every one of them i just wanted beans and wings beans and cleans you gonna, uh, yeah. i got, I got yeah, you, 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 you got a whole buffet but beans. You're gonna smell real pleasant yeah it's gonna be tough in a little bit when the <laughs> when the hoe hits what's the number one thing you want for christmas a uh, digital air gauge from landon huffman Mama Judy, you got you go to the dessert table, you got a sampler of it. What all's on there? I don't know, but I got one of everything. Gonna find out what you like the best? I already parking across the street. Got a packed house here at the Huffman Racing Christmas Party. We had a great 2023 season and uh it's really cool to see everybody come here together and celebrate and have a good time and uh it's a lot of work uh, going into each and every race weekend. I know I've worked with a lot of different people this year, and uh, seeing everybody here is uh, is pretty neat, and I really appreciate it. I'm blessed, and uh, to get to do what I get to do every weekend on a uh, Saturday night basis is pretty cool. So thank you guys so much. Enjoy the food. If you haven't ate, there's food in the back. If you haven't drank, there's liquor there and beer. Um, but we do have extra food and extra liquor. And we have shallow side here, so uh, <laughs> if you guys weren't here last year, shallow sides kick ass, they're a great rock band, they're up there on the charts, I don't know what all the special stuff is, but they're badass, and they sing a lot, and they like to drink too, and usually by the end they're pretty drunk as well, um, yeah. but, 
but they're gonna have a good time. But uh, thank you guys so much. Enjoy yourself. Like I said, go to the back, eat, drink the food, or drink the food. Eat the food, drink the liquor that we've got. Thank you to uh, Sugarlands and High Rock Vodka. And uh, thank you guys so much for all the help and support all year this year. It means a lot, and enjoy yourself. So thank you guys. Shout out to everybody. Well, I'm going to go ahead and just drink the damn thing like it says and see what happens. Rob's starting to find the cut the lights out. Party really about to get going now. Fred done raided the stash. What'd you get? Pina colada, secret cream, banana pudding. Banana pudding. RJ, what do you want? A million dollars would be nice. A million dollars. Well, the hell of a landing ain't got that over there. 13 year old landed up in his I don't feel like it was that bad. You're just mad. You're just mad because you got kicked okay. out. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's really You did get replaced. Well, I'm talking about a little Fred, we got more liquor here than we did at the store. It was FREE. That's what damn what you do. Take a swallow? Hell, you choking over <laughs> here. Damn, death. No. We got High Rock, three bottles of Shime, Flavor Chime. Two bottles. Two bottles of High Rock. Two bottles of High Rock There's here. Fred behind. Claus. The other one's over there. You look like the chews cone on the restarts. <laughs> yeah. Big <laughs> cone. Outside, outside, inside. inside. <laughs> What's the number one thing on top of your Christmas list you want? My Christmas list is world peace. <laughs> That's it. We're going ahead carrying this thing on back to Jefferson, Georgia. Had a good time here with the Huffmans. Really appreciate the invite. A little over three hour trip back. Fred trying to put all the liquor in one box just in case we got stopped. So uh, enjoyed it. Big thank you to Mama Huffman, Rob, Landon, Brooke, the whole Huffman family. So uh, had a real good time. Well, we made it back safe and sound to Jefferson, Georgia about 1.30 in the morning. So I uh, had a real good time. Appreciate everybody, and you know, inviting us up there. Landon, his family had a great time. Hopefully, we'll uh, have you an update on Bittersweet in the coming weeks. But uh, we should see you again before Christmas, as the plan is still to get ready for the New Year's bash at Dillon Motor Speedway. But if I don't see you again, hope everybody has a Merry Christmas and a uh, Happy New Year. But I can promise you, we'll see you for then. But uh, other than that, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Cheers.